Why do you want to work for Office Max? I was a senior aviation engineer at Boeing, but I just got downsized. I haven't been able to find anything in aeronautics, so I thought I might have better luck working in a stockroom. Now you know we only pay $9 an hour to start. That's okay. Congratulations, you're hired. My new responsibilities involve receiving stock replenishments and getting them onto the store floor. Here in Phoenix, our shipments come from a central distribution center in Las Vegas. I'm real excited to unload my first truck and show them what an efficient worker I am. Right now my co-workers are getting the pallets off the truck. There's no need for forklifts, they do all the unloading with pallet jacks. We're not going to unpack these today. We'll handle this shipment tomorrow. The boss told me we need to get the items in these boxes out onto the sales floor. That sounds like it should be pretty straightforward. Let's look in the box and see what we've got. Oh no! No! The boss says we need to sort all the items into shopping carts like this one. That way, when we take new stock out onto the sales floor, if a customer asks for help, we can leave the cart and assist them. because the merchandise is scattered throughout the store. In addition to all the items we had to stock on the floor here at Office Max, we have to put some other items in overstock. In fact, I just put the last of the folders right up here. As you can imagine, that was a long ways up for a little guy like me. I sure hope I don't fall. Hi, Mr. Bill. Thanks again for coming to meet me here today. Uh, there are a few things I want to go over with you. Um, how are you healing? Well, the doctors tell me it looks like I broke 206 bones, but I'll recover after a couple months of bed rest. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Unfortunately, I'm afraid that I've only got more bad news for you. You see, we need someone who's going to be reliable and hear every shipment, and I'm just not sure that I can count on you. I'm afraid I'm going to have to let you go today, Mr. Bill. Workers' compensation? I'm sorry, Mr. Bill, but my legal people tell me that workmen's compensation does not cover little talking plastic gummy toys. <laughs>